Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Civilization V. So we had a little raid up here, which was annoying, but we did take Venice, you know, our goal, which has basically allowed us to secure the north sort of western side of our continent, which is awesome. Uh, this looks to be a pretty decently sized continent. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's going to be interesting to see what happens here, but for now we'll just sort of focus on our little... Our little side of the universe. There's a barbarian encampment people want to get rid of, um, and Poland has allied with Panama City. Uh, good things to know. Uh, and I pro should probably try to get some influence with uh, with uh, some of the other worlds. I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, they'll pay us four gold per turn for embassy and uh, some salt. Um, I'll take that for now. I think. I don't think that's a horrible deal. I do have two trade routes available, and I should probably uh, get on to, to working onto one of those. I thought I was building a caravan somewhere, but I guess I am not. That's fine. Um, getting our stuff rebuilt, which is good. It would be really good to get a road all the way down to here, which I believe I was working on. Um, somebody has completed Stonehenge, which is too bad. Even blue feet. Uh, and somebody's founded a religion, uh, which, you know, it would have been really nice to found a religion, but I don't think we're going to be able to get enough faith uh, to get up to 200 to get a great profit to found a religion uh, in time. So, that's a thing. Um, Panama City. What did they want, actually? What did it say? Seeks new riches. They have learned rumors that of marble. It will be greatly if you connect this resource to your trade network. I do have marble, I think, right here. No, it's salt mine. Silver mine. Salt mine. Stone. Salt. Iron. Gold. I thought I had marble somewhere around here. Iron, iron. Salt. Stone. Is there a... Oh, and uh, one of the viewers kindly pointed out that I can, I can queue up research, so I should really do that. Um, God, I keep thinking I can use middle mouse click to scroll right on this screen, but I cannot. Uh, currency is always a fantastic thing to go for, uh, just to get, you know, the money rolling, especially with the markets. Um, and also improving our uh, military is always something that I'm, I'm a big fan of, because we're going, you know, conquest here. Uh, pikemen would not be bad, as, you know, horsemen, of course, are great. Wow, lots of options. Hmm. If I go down this route, I'll get crossbowmen, and this, of course the knights. I can build a great wall, composite bowmen. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do, great house, lighthouse. Um, God, this is good too, because I can get extra food from sea tiles um, and sea resources. God, there's so many things. I, I, I can't focus, and that's part of the problem. But let's, let's get, I do want to get the... Uh, the horseback riding, and I'm gonna get construction. Um, I think these three are the ones I really want to do. Getting to currency would be great uh, early on, but I think I'm gonna focus on those three for now and see what happens. So I've got them queued up, thanks to uh, holy crap techno, I believe is. Uh, sorry, I said holy crap because my brain totally spaced out on who I wanted to thank. Uh, but I believe it's techno who is the guy I want to thank. Yes, and I want you to build a road. I want to connect these cities because uh, it will bring more happiness to the to the empire. We also have a courthouse being built in Venice, which will definitely help uh, make Venice a happier place to be in the world. So that is good. What did this say? Assur has grown. Yes, finally we've got a level four city, considering that uh, Venice over here was level five or something like that when I conquered it. Um, nothing else to really see. We're in the, now we're very much in the, the phase of the game where I just, you know, you're constantly building. Um, yeah, they want furs, good for them. Uh, you're constantly just sort of going from turn to turn. So that's good. Why does it look like I have, like, an industrial complex here? I mean, I realize that's like a, a granary or something like that. But, or maybe, I don't know, is that going to be my, li my library? Interesting. Uh, do you have a road up here already? 
does not look like it. Who needs production? Who needs production? What did you just finish building? <laughs> Circus gives me happiness. That would be very good. Watermill gives me more food and production. Um, I think we should definitely do that just because we're on this river here. Um, please wait. <laughs> yeah, so now we're going to be definitely in the uh, please wait stage of the game as we wait for all the other other uh, peoples to go. And we have constructed the Great Library, which gives us one free technology, provides a free library in the city in which it was built, um, which of course is fantastic. Uh, so what do we want to get for free? What we want to get for free is something expensive. Probably currency, which I was just discussing. God, it would have been really good to have horseback riding so I could just jump to something like civil service. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to think I'm going to take currency. Because uh, per currency, you know, you get the market, and markets are great. So yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Awesome. Better is bread with a happy heart. Um, and yes, you need a new construction project. Uh, a, uh, you have no place to work in the water, so I don't think getting a work boat for you makes any sense. Um, but what about getting you... A mint, each source of gold and silver works to produce two gold. We have uh, one source of, of gold, so that would give us two extra gold for the gold. Market, markets increase the amount of gold the city generates. Try it outside the blah, 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 blah. I think I'm going to get the mint, but I do want to get a caravan going relatively soon here. And yeah, Venice uh, wants incest. Incest. <laughs> Venice wants incense. <laughs> I seriously just said Venice wants incest. Uh, the words that come out of my mouth sometimes, it's pretty funny. Alright, waiting. Processing turn for player 8. Um, and somebody wants a new natural wonder, like I have control over that. Okay, so you need something new. I think it's time for you to get, uh... Why would you want a mint? Do I have... I got silver there, salt there, two salt mines, and a silver mine. I guess a mint wouldn't be the worst thing in the world to build here. I mean, you should have a work boat, right? Which wants to come out to here and start fishing. All right, cool. So we're fishing down here. You could use some some fishing as well. Get that get that uh, def defishination the of the ocean started nice and early. The sooner we can uh, fishinate defishinate the oceans, the better. Yep, defishinate totally a word. Don't you all agree? Deficient 8 is totally a word. <laughs> Alright, next turn. I think deficient 8 is totally a word. Oh look, we're actually gaining a decent amount of, uh, of culture. It's not like gaining a ton of faith. But uh, gaining a decent amount of culture, so that's good. A horse. A horse. My kingdom for a all right. horse. So a lot of, we just got horseback riding, which is great. A lot of things just happened, though. Yes, we've connected uh, these two cities, which is really good. Uh, we've lost a deal with Maria for horses. Yeah, I don't need it anymore. Deal for salt. And a deal f where provided gold to us every turn. Yeah, I don't need the gold anymore because I have my own source of gold. So, yeah, I'm not too worried about that. Um, what do you need? Production. Of course you need production. Um... It would be good to produce one extra production. That is a, not a bad uh, thing to to get right there. Um, circus gives you happiness. Getting happiness wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Um, this would give me culture. This would give me faith. Let's get that faith in there. Why not? <laughs> Who needs orders? Um, I want to keep building these roads. So if we can get uh, this road network finished through here, then Nimrod will be happier as well. I'm totally calling that city Nimrod from now on. <laughs> I should have renamed it Nimrod. <laughs> Alright, you want uh, to give me 30 gold, and you want to accept an embassy from me in exchange for salt. Sure. That allows me to see more, which is excellent. Um, would be nice to get another explorer going. I think that's what I'll do next. I would also like to get a trade uh, network going. 
Krakow, I believe, is the capital of, uh, no, Warsaw has to be the capital of Poland. Wow, our cities are tiny. I didn't realize how slow our cities were to, to being, uh, upgrading. To being upgrading. God, sometimes I just, words do not come out well out of my mouth. Yeah, food production is really slow in some of these cities. And that is not the greatest thing in the world for me, I think. Um, choose production. Yes, you finished the courthouse, so you're finally ready to be a worthwhile place. I... What the hell? Caravan Assery? Land trade aspiration from this city have 50% increase in range. Produce an additional two gold when connecting to another civilization. Hmm, interesting. Uh, but what I really need you to do is expand. And I think a workboat would be the best for that. Let me see this city for a second here. What are you working? Interesting. Ah, you're, this is why, because you're working the gold mine. If I, had, if, I, if I swapped this out for this or something like that, you would be uh, doing better. Got it. We're losing a butt ton of money. That's the other thing we got to be worried about. But ton is still, of course, an actual unit. Ooh, got a headache all of a sudden. Sorry. Apologize. All right, you can't, uh, you can't build my road yet. But the sooner the better. We'll get the, this road network completed. This will also help, of course, the movement of my armies. Uh, somebody already enhanced their religion. Um, and Poland has declared that they're protecting Ormus. Um, I should probably uh, start protect declaring, you know, allying with cities, but... Um, you are mercantile. City state will provide extra the empire and manufacture. Is irrational. Random with its requests. Got it. Um, where are the other city states? We got two up here, Ormus and these guys. They want you to discover a natural wonder. Yeah, that's probably not going to happen. Um, yeah, I'll protect you. See what ha happens there. I like just clicking buttons and seeing what happens. <laughs> Which is probably the most irritating thing for anybody watching this. All right. Yeah, no progress towards a golden age, which is not surprising. Um, so we've completed a, a mint in our capital of Asher. Let's get a, a caravan going. I think caravan's a good idea. We can get some trade maybe with uh, Lisbon. Might not be the worst idea in the world. All the peoples moving in all the ways. What are you doing, Poland? I don't like this little these troops here. Where are you? What are you doing, Poland? Gotta watch these Polish troops very carefully. What are you doing, Poland? All right, they're going away. And Poland has founded Confucianism, which means there's only one religion left, and it, we're probably not going to finish it. Which is fine. We did connect uh, Nimrod, which is good. That will get us some more happiness, I believe. Discovery of Natural Wonders, 16. Generated from number of cities. Hmm. Interesting. What do we got here? And yeah, they founded that religion. And we don't have bridge building, so we're basically, these cities are basically stuck on the other side of the world. Um, well, let's automate this worker. And then we're going to get some iron here in a second, which is good. Because we are researching iron working, so having iron would be great. And somebody already entered the medieval era. Hmm. We may need to be considering looking at targets for conquest, uh... Our, our friends down here may be uh, right for the taking. 
you need to build something. Do you have a granary? Um, you don't, but you don't need one. I mean, you do. <laughs> uh, it would be nice to get you something that would, you know, help out the team. We're losing a ton of money. Well, not really a ton. We're losing four. If four is the definition of a ton, then we're losing a ton. But we need to... I need to consider who I'm going to engage in war. And I think, um... You know, we're not the world's most progressive. These guys may be the, the target. Esser wants wine. I'd love to give you wine, Esser. But, uh... I don't know where I'm going to get some from. Um, is the stables really what I want to build here? It's going to cost me one gold. Whereas the market's at least going to generate me gold. I'm going to get the market, actually. Even though it's a tiny city. Um, it would be nice if my city's upgraded any time in the near future. Nivene will update in five turns. Card the... Duli Ninurtak, that's a, a name and a half. They're gonna upgrade in a, in a in billion years now, so it might be time to switch to the honor tree, although each city you found will increase the culture cost of policies by 33% less than normal. Um, that's not bad. Mediocracy, plus one happiness for each city you own connected to my capital, minus 5% unhappiness from citizens in non-occupied cities. Um, mediocracy, meritocracy, mediocracy, meritocracy may be the right thing to get here. Um, and then going to honor, which will allow me to conquer things. Um, which I think, so I think I'm going to go for meritocracy and then start this line. Do I get something if I get all, everything? Free great person of my choice. I mean, I could theoretically found a religion that way. All right, my, my people are happy. I'm losing a butt ton of money. Mm, two from trade routes between your cities and other civilizations. But we're about to get the, uh... Oh, need to build something. Hmm. Yeah, probably get that mint here, too. Who needs orders? Oh, you need orders. Cause you, you need me to build you a, uh... To work the waters. Till the ocean. Everyone knows you can tell the ocean. Oh, they got a trade route going by sea. I see. I see, I said. Good, my cities are growing. My cities are growing. Yes, let's get the market, because I do want the monies. Alright, where would be good... How far can we establish a trade route? For one thing, why won't you... Uh, Hmm, something weird's going on here. You caravan. Who needs order? The caravan, but I can't actually do anything with it. Why can't I do anything with it? I'm missing something here, brain. What am I doing wrong? Oh, of course, because I need to, uh... Establish a trade route. So I can do to... So this will give me plus two gold for... No, this will give me plus one gold per turn. Um, let me just make sure I'm reading this one. Right. My revenue, I gain 1.79 gold per turn. And I gain one science per turn. They gain two science per turn. Got it. This gives me more science, or more gold, same amount of science. They get less gold and the same amount of science. Um, this just gives me straight up four gold for one gold with Columbo. Might make sense just to, to trade between Columbo. Although this does help me. This does give me extra science. Let's do lods. Alright, cool. So we got, uh, we got trade route established. 
and that's going to help us out. And this is where we're going to end the episode. So I thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. On the next episode, you guys can expect a war maybe soon in the future. I, I need to know who to target. Um, the Polish are strong. I don't know what's going on with the Ethiopians. Uh, or whatever's or anything beyond the, uh, the, the shadow over here. Um, so yeah, it's, we're, we're in an interesting place right now. But I think we're doing good, and I thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all on the next episode.